This is a uh, red feather with grep packs once again uh, in Kendall Li in Caden Live. In uh, Caden Live, uh, we're going to talk about editing audio or video, whichever one you want to do separately, uh, depending on your situation. But the, in order to do the audio, there's a couple ways you can do this. Uh, the first one is to click on Project and go down to Extract Audio. Now notice, that's going to turn it into a WAV file. The cool thing about this is when it saves it as a WAV file, it puts it right where the original video is located, so it's easy to find. The other way to do this is to come down here where your vi uh, video and audio is and right click and click on group clips. Now notice I no longer have the blue section which is, was binding them together. They are now separate entities. I can move one or the other. Now, depending on whether I wanted to audio, um, edit my video or edit my audio, I would have that one highlighted. For example, I now have my audio highlighted. If I go down to my razor tool, click on it, come up to where I would want to edit the audio, I can then clip, then clip again. Now as you notice, I can now separate this audio. Now, uh, say if I wanted to drop some music in or right where the section was, I could drag, I could uh, call in an audio, music audio file, drop it right in there, bind those together. As you'll notice um, in this clip, I hear myself uh, kind of smacking my lips a little. That's a good example. Oh, okay. Did you hear that? But the problem is, it's so tight together, I cannot figure out where that is. So if I go down here to my zoom tool, I can zoom it as far as I want to go. And notice what's happening up here. When I zoomed it, I get more of a thin line right there. So if we back it up, Listen again. Okay, so I noticed because I zoomed, because I zoomed it, I can see where I've got, you know, less sound right there to to where I hear that little smacking of the lips or what have you. I can even zoom it in a little bit more. Uh, when you do this, uh, of course, it makes the video go a little faster. You kind of have to play with it a little bit. Okay, so I'm right about there. So let's see if we can uh, remove that. Um, got this whole space right there. Let's take our razor tool. I'm just going to go ahead and get right on that line. And take a pointer again. And move our line where we heard the smacking. Gonna make another clip right there. Get our pointer back. <clears throat> We're gonna remove this uh, section Right now we just move it over there, pull that in, drop it back, and zoom back down, move this over further, make sure our video is all the way back. So as you'll notice, the uh, noise is gone now, I've removed it. Um, Here's a good example of editing in general. But the uh, issue is now that I have a shorter audio than I do the video. Now that leaves me a couple of choices. Either I can just expand by using the arrow and dragging it to even it up. Or I can decrease my video length. Or 
I can bring in extra audio, you know, whatever I feel like doing, or, or actually whatever you feel like doing. Uh, it's just for your purpose to show you how to edit the audio or video. There's just so many different things you can do with Caden, uh, Caden Live. It's amazing. The main thing to do is not get frustrated and quit. Keep on going. The power of Linux is amazing. And the power of Caden Live. The two combined together, you just can't go wrong. Well, that's the end of this video, and I hope you've enjoyed it. Please like, and share, and subscribe.